What's up, friends and fans? Jake here, and today we are looking at a data mine concerning Mario Kart 8 Deluxe's DLC. Now, for whatever reason you want to be completely surprised by which courses are being remastered, this is your time to click away, do it now, and okay. So, back around when the first wave launched, data miners like FishGuy6564 on Twitter were able to find strings of text that said which Nintendo system future DLC tracks were coming from. So, with the release of Wave 2, we can now observe that those origin listings were actually correct in predicting the tracks that would be in future cups. So for example, Fish Guy listed Tour, SNES, N64, and DS tracks for the Turnip Cup, and that aligns perfectly with what was revealed. So with this new knowledge, we can kind of with like relative confidence assume that the rest of the cups will follow suit in accordance to this data mine. So this gives us a pretty good hint at what tracks are coming. And rather than list out system names at you all, I have created this handy chart for anticipating what future waves will consist of. So yeah, take your screenshots now. Okay, crunching the numbers, what this means is that in the remaining waves of DLC, we should be seeing 10 city-themed tracks from tour, plus six new tracks that either debut in tour or come to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe first, like Sky High Sunday. There is actually only one track in Mario Kart Tour that fits this billing, being Merry Mountain. So the other five are, as of now, a total mystery to us. But moving on, we have four listed courses for the GameCube, four from the Wii, three from GBA, two from 3DS, two from DS, one more from SNES, and no more tracks from Mario Kart 64. But once again, as a reminder, I just want to say that we can't count on this information being 100% correct because maybe some of it is placeholder, maybe some of it could change. But given that Wave 2's listing was entirely right, we are pretty confident in it. And that's going to do it for this video. So let me know in the comments below what you think of these findings. Personally, four double dash tracks is not a lot, but I will take it. And I'm kind of excited about these six newish tracks like Sky High Sunday that we'll be getting because it feels like those could be themed after just about anything. So it's fun. Uh, but again, let me know where your head is at. And remember to come back here in just a couple of days for the launch of Wave 2. And for everything else in games, you're already in the right place. So just let me explain. I'm Jake, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.